here's their actual video because I video bombed the last time when you saw in the last video, which was By me. Yeah, we know that. But I guess eight minutes ago. I guess I'll say that. Okay, so we this time I have my special someone here. Okay, Cindy. And we're gonna be doing the ten question Valentine's Day tag. That was terrible. Okay, so let's get started, shall we? What is your favorite Valentine's Day treat? I love chocolate. Doesn't matter what kind of chocolate. I need to have chocolate. Chocolate strawberries? Heck yeah. Chocolate pretzels? Heck yeah. See? What's your treat? Mine is that I like chocolate hearts. <laughs> yep. We both love chocolate. Question number two. Sweetheart or chocolate covered strawberries? Chalk her strawberries. Two hearts. She has been judged. Okay, question number three. Okay, by the way, I don't like strawberry, chocolate strawberries. I don't eat strawberries. I like chocolate, but I don't like strawberries. Okay. <laughs> so she likes bad foods. One good foods. Next question! Question number three. What was your favorite Valentine's Day memory? Oh, it was last year. I had to go on a class trip, and it was tough because he, my boyfriend, planned out this perfect date. And then after I told him that I had to go on a trip to the Holocaust Museum with my awesome teacher and other people, yeah. So when I got back from the trip, he had a bouquet of flowers and chocolates waiting for me. And I was like, ah! It was the greatest Valentine's Day ever, considering that was my first Valentine's Day ever that I ever got anything like that. So, woo. Me, this is my first Valentine's Day. I never had one last year. I wasn't dating at that time. Speak louder. I wasn't dating at that time. Now I am dating. So, so that's why she loved it. Yes. And I text her boyfriend all the time, just bugging him about it. Yes. Question number four. What movie would you rather watch on Valentine's Day? Pretty Woman or You've Got Mail? I don't know any of these movies. Do you know any of these movies? No. It's not like chick flicks. I don't like chick flicks. Get it right! Question number five. What celeb would you not mind having as your valentine. Hmm. Sorry Dawson, I know the answer to that one. Yeah, before it was a thing. I'm a big fan of her, yes. And Ms. Dawson, if you're watching this video, I want to brag your thumbs up. But, um, I'm a big fan of you and I would love to have you as a valentine. Don't have a valentine, uh, forget it, forget it, let's just keep going. <laughs> to be honest, I don't really care about celebrities. If I could have a president as my valentine, it would be Abraham Lincoln. Can I make a president instead of a celebrity thing? I guess so. I'm going to do it anyway. Question number six. What would you do on your perfect valentine's date? Um, well, since I couldn't really have Valentine's Day dinner, my boyfriend actually making dinner for him, so I guess I'll do that. And then for dessert, we'll go out for ice cream, which I would love. And then we can watch movies or just hang out with a couple, you know? Like Where? Here. His house. Probably. I don't know. It's going to be his house. So that's my perfect Valentine's Day date. What's yours? I'll get paid in movie. Not that hard to please. <laughs> and what about last night with Kevin Hart and Regina Hall? Alright, question number seven. Red or pink lips on Valentine's Day? Red. Pink. I don't like pink, so let's go with red. I think red's a better color for the holiday anyway. Question number eight. What is your ideal Valentine's Day date outfit? I'm actually wearing... I want a fancy blouse, and I'm going to have just regular red pants, and then I'm going to have fancy shoes. That's my usual Valentine's Day 
date outfit. What's yours? This, not mine. No. Well, you know, I'm not going anywhere. If you were to go on a date, what would you wear? I will wear my red and black plaid shirt. So cute. My black skinny jeans. And my black heels. Okay. So, question number nine. Homemade or store-bought gifts? I like homemade. I mean, it's really nice when someone buys you a gift, but it's worth a lot more to put more thought into it and try to make it really, really nice, especially when you're making it. So it's like more worthwhile to have homemade. So what's your, what do you think? I'll say homemade. No, it's unanimous. It's homemade for both of us. Question number 10. Would you wear your hair up or hair down for a date night? Hair down. Hair down. Like, I got my hair done for the occasion of tonight. So, hair down. Ten questions out of here. Woo! Sorry, JK, I scared you. JK loves being on camera. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, you can do the video as well. I'm not going to say, you can't do the video, I did it, but you can, no, I can tag all of you to do this video. <laughs> um, comment, like, subscribe, the usual, you know, I'll post last week's video, I not, might not post yesterday's video, but you know, if, if I, you want to watch it, just click subscribe and then go to my channel and then go click on videos and then you see a whole bunch of videos and watch all of them because they're awesome and I'll put a link for Beatrice's channel somewhere below if it's not somewhere here it's going to be in the comment section just click on that subscribe to her channel I'm probably going to do a Valentine's Day video for her channel too but you know we'll see what happens so that's about it uh, B, any follow up words? <laughs> Sorry, I'm on Facebook. Um, I want to make a shout out to. No shout outs! And that's a goodbye! That's well, all you need! Uh, of course, okay, Queen B, don't forget, and peace.